PI investigating your future renters is a huge part of your leasing process, and tenant screening is your primary tool. With your applicant's background screening report in hand, you can easily look for clues of potential red flags. Cross-reference with the source of your information. First, you're going to want to double check that the information on the background report matches the information given on the rental application and ID cards. This includes the names, descriptors, date of birth, social security number, and driver's license number. Typos can happen. Be skeptical of criminal hits. If your applicant has a very common name and happens to have the exact date of birth as a former convict, it's likely their record may appear. Make sure your screening service provides a photo with most of their sex offender registry hits so you can determine if they are the same person. Otherwise, talk to your applicant about the conviction. If he or she denies it, they have the right to dispute it through your provider's consumer relations department. Be wary of fraudulent pay stubs. Under the guise that it can help independent contractors, business owners, and students report income, Fraudulent pay stub companies that produce pay stubs conduct no third-party verification that the information input into the generator is true. To protect yourself, cross-reference the employment section on your report and perform a verbal verification. With a quality resident screening provider, you don't need to resort to questionable practices to protect your property. As long as you take a thorough look into the tenant's background screening report, you'll pick up on enough clues to be your own private investigator. Click the link in the description box to read the full article.